Hey internet fans, this is Infinity Parks, and today I'll be doing a review on the Black Series 6 inch, well he's 7 because he's super tall, of the Imperial Death Trooper. This is not the specialist variant with the grenades and the pauldron, this is just the variant without any of that and just the normal gun. Um, so let's get into it. So this guy is extremely tall. This, uh, in universe, they are about six feet five inches tall, which is about four more inches taller than I am. So, yeah, he's really tall. Um, let me just take his accessories off. So he, there's his helmet detail. He's got some green on the lenses. It's gonna be hard to pick up, but he does have some green tint on it as well as the breather thingies down here. I think they're rebreathers. Um, he's got an all black. I'll go quickly over him because I have a larger figure that I've already done a review of, so this is just gonna be a brief rundown. Plus I'll probably get the, the specialist version anyway, so it'll be quite the same, just the other one's bigger. Um, he's got pouches up here at the front, Darth Vader-esque belt buckle. Another pouch in the back with a large thermal detonator. And he's got a slot for the t the blaster pistol, repeater pistol. And that can be slotted in really easily. I forgot how I did it earlier. I think I put the clip in first. And like that. And it just sits in like that. And he's got a the the D, uh, E11 uh, modified pistol, monster, modified blaster rifle. There you go. And it's got just a few paint applications, just like that red line there. And then that's all of it. Yeah, it's just that red line. Oh, and some silver tint in the front. So yeah, that's the blaster rifle. And he can clip onto that. Um, so yeah, he's really tall, uh, just like Krennic, I think this is my version, but he's got a loose leg again, so him and Krennic always fall down when I pose them, and speaking of Krennic, these guys protect him, or just high-ranking Imperial officials, so we'll see you with Grand Admiral Thrawn and uh, Rebels, and since he goes with Krennic, I have a Krennic. You can just see how they look together. Just a brief. But yeah. So let me just pose him a little bit differently. Since they are the bodyguards of him. So there's Krennic and there's the trooper right next to him. And this is like they're on the floor together. So like they this is how they would be standing and the Death Trooper is still taller than him. There. Now they're still tall. And quickly let me show you the box. So this is the box. So this is Real Death Trooper. Number 25. This is not a retail exclusive. I found mine at the Disney store in Disney Springs. Um, World of Disney. Looked everywhere, and that's all I could find of him. Oh wow! Never noticed that. On the side here it shows. You know, it says Death, and then it says Trooper. The TR of Trooper, so Death Trooper. I never noticed that on any of them, so I'll have to go back and check. Um, so the description says the elite soldiers of the Imperial Intelligence Death Troopers are. Encased in specialized stormtrooper armor with a dark, ominous gleam. These soldiers serve as bodyguards and enforcers for Director Krennic, a highly placed officer within the Advanced Weapons Research Division of the Empire. Empire, I said Emperor. Um, so yeah. It's got the Star Wars Black Series logo. Faint picture of the Death Trooper there. And number 25. And it says Imperial Death Trooper. So yeah, that is the Death Trooper, and now on to an announcement. So most of you that are subscribed to 
Jedi Master 738 saw her video today of that she's going to Disney World. So yeah, I'm taking her to Disney World. So after weeks, ever since December 30th, I'm trying to convince her to come here. So she's finally coming. So she's coming in March, which is the countdown is today. Right now it's 46 days. So 46 more days till then. I'm really excited. We are both are to have her come here. So yeah, that is the review and announcement that she's coming here to Disney World. So this is Infinity Parks signing out.